Children with juvenile localized scleroderma seem to do very well on a methotrexate regimen. That's according to Dr. Francesco Zulian, who reported these results at the European Pediatric Rheumatology Society Congress in Valencia, Spain. We treat the patient, uh, uh, the first group, uh, on, uh, with methotrexate and prednisone for three months, then uh, just prednisone for nine months more, and the second group with uh, prednisone and placebo, and then uh, uh, with placebo alone for nine months. And the results were quite interesting. Uh, at the end of 12 month follow-up, uh, around 70% of patients on the methotrexate group responded, were in remission, while uh, just 29% in the placebo uh, group. In the placebo group, the prednisone was used during the first three months of treatment, then was tapered down to zero during the fourth month. So they stayed for uh, more than eight months with uh, no, no treatment at all. We found out that this, uh, uh, this treatment uh, should be used as early as possible because uh, um, sometimes we see patients in our uh, department as a rheumatologist with a very bad flexion contraction of the limbs uh, disfiguration of the face in the in coupe de sabre or peyromber, the subtype. And so it is a very important to stop the disease at the early onset. This gives the opportunity to the children to uh, get better very soon and uh, uh, to have a, a better quality of life. This is Michelle Sullivan reporting for Global Medical News Network.